Welcome back to Bowser You. We are looking at a hint for this level now, because again, it's just right after the last one. And of course, I see the demoralizing thing, which I kind of I kind of figured this was the case, but this is a two-star level. Like, how could it not be? Because it seems so simple, like there's nothing you can use, so of course it must be low star, because it's not super convoluted, but I just don't see what move you can make. So I'm gonna take a hint. Gentle nudge. You will have to create both rules, belt is wall and flag is win. Where does Baba need to be when that happens? That is such a pointless hint, I know. Remember that belt remains right or up even after you disconnect the rule. Okay, that is something that is significant. Okay, that, that one might have cracked it. That one might have been it, because I think the only thing it means... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. Ah. Uh, kind of. Like, I think it just means we start off by doing like this and make belt this up, and then I can go in and fetch this again. That's something I wasn't really doing, but like, I knew I could do that, I guess, but not why you would want to. And then if we now push the, uh, oh god, no, but how is this going to work? We're going to need like both here, I feel. How is this going to work? I think I see what I need to do. I need to have the boulder be right here, like one tile above me, while up is also no, while right is also one tile above. No? Well, oh god. It's like they need to be in tandem so that when we make belt is right, the the rock does not go to the right. It stays here so that we can then make belt is up again when we're like in here, but that I don't think that's possible. Oh boy. If we make belt is right... Like, this this won't do anything. This won't matter if I push this in here. Like, I, I don't know what that would do. It's like I need this to, to happen when I'm all the way on the left, so yeah, I mean, that that gave me an idea, but I don't see how you could do it still. I don't understand how you would, like, have two things. It's like we need to have two things lined up here, both going up at the same time, so that we can make belt is right. So that, like, the the rock will still be in this line when we then change it back to belt us up, but I don't see how you can do that. So hold on. Belt us up. Get this back out. Belt us right. And then we get the right over here, like that? There we go. There we go, and then... Okay, this might be it. And then we just push belt. Where do we want to, like, stop it? I mean, just here? I think I got it. Finally. Okay. And that hint was good. That was a good hint. The first one is stupid and pointless, because yes, a baby can see that we want to be in the flag. Like... That doesn't make any sense. But there we go. Okay. Got it. Yeah, again, some of these are just, like, dumb. Like, th this is just saying what you can see in the level. But this one was good because that does, like, put that in your 
your mind that like, okay, you have to set something up and then make use of one of the words up or right, I guess. I don't know, it's very hit or miss, those, those hints. Lock the door. This is another one of those that feels like I didn't really, like, think too much about. Or at least I didn't really understand all the mechanics at that point. So we're going to, once again... Once again, we want Fungus and Love is Win. Isn't this easy? I don't think it's easy, but like, yeah, we, we want the belt here. We want the belt somewhere, like, here facing right, and the bug to be somewhere up here. No, no, no. I thought the bug would be able to move in some way, but I guess it doesn't. Hmm. Yeah, bug can never move. And we can't turn into anything. We can't do bug is you. Bug is bug and belt is belt, so we can't turn them into anything. Yeah, if we could have the the bug move, it could, like, walk down and then get shifted to the right by the belt. But that's not gonna happen. Baba's shift, we tried that, all of this stuff. And, like, that doesn't really do anything that we want. Yeah, that, that doesn't, like, help me at that point. We can just move it, like, one tile over. Hmm. We can't get the belt, like, in here or something. What are we gonna use the bug for? We can get the bug out like that. I'm not sure I ever figured that out back then. But still, what would the bug do? Why would the bug ever be helpful? Is it something where, like, if bug and belt are on the same tile and they're both shift at the same time, do they just shift each other? Kind of simulating move? That might be what, what it is. In which case, we would want them, like, facing left so that they spend the longest amount of time moving. This might be it, like that. And then make sure we don't do this... We need to push shift in at the same time. And then we need to do it, like, all the way up here. This is probably it. This is probably it. We can just have it, like, here. That's fine. Like, I think I'm gonna have way too much time. Way more time than you need. Assuming this actually works the way I think it will work. Because they should both shift each other at the same time. Are they gonna turn around, though? They, they might not turn around, but I have, like, more than enough time, even if they don't. Yeah, okay, they don't turn around, that's fine. We can just do it the other way around. So, uh... We can salvage this, just get Baba's shift back again. So it's a pseudo-move, it's not quite move. Because they can't... They can't turn at the end, they just shift into walls, but yeah, it's still, still more than enough. So that's another one done. There we go. All right, that's a cool one. That's definitely a, an older and wiser moment as well, where like, I don't think I would have really understood that mechanic back when I was here the first time. 
Like, the, the thinking required? I don't know. So now... I guess we continue with the numbers for now, so factory. Hopefully this one is the same, where, yeah, I just, like, didn't really think about it too much, didn't really understand the mechanics back then. So flag is win, and we need to get to flag, and we don't have any way to do anything else with a flag. So we just need to get through all those doors, which makes it seem like we need the boxes to die to create keys that can then open the doors. And I'm the key. What is the weak gonna do here? Why would we even need that? Because, like, if we do... Oh, uh... Oh, crap. I guess that's, that's a problem. That is already a problem. Okay, wait. It sh should be fine. Because we can do... No, it's not really... Not really fine. Hmm. I want to make boxes you and has key. Either boxes you and has key, or boxes you, box has key. But it doesn't seem like we can do that at the same time. Key is open. And again, what would we use weak for here? I can't see why we would ever want weak, because, like, the box is always weak, so that's not going to change. The only thing we could ever make weak is key, and why would I want that when the key is open anyway, and the bugs are defeat anyway? So weak just seems like a completely pointless word. As far as I can see... As far as I can see, weak is useless in this level. Except if we, like, need the block for some reason to push something in, but... Can't see why we would. Like, we can push the words partially through here and make something happen. That might be it. Oh, is that why we have weak? So we can, like, turn into box, but then... How would I do that? Now, I'm not sure how that would happen. Plus, I, I can't, like, get this key as you up here anyway. We can do bug is... What happens if we do, like, bug is defeat and weak? If we get weak over here? What happens if we do that? Just like, this kind of thing. Box is you. Oh god, this is gonna be a problem. I need five of these boxes at least to survive. Maybe four, I mean, probably five, because I mean, we have one key over there, but we need to be something as well. So like... Uh, I don't know how to not kill them all. How do I not kill them all? Okay, there we go. That works a little bit. There we go. Bug is defeat and weak. But then... Okay. it's It still does work. It is defeat, but it's also weak. I don't know, okay, this is, we still don't know exactly how this works as a mechanic, but I, hey, I guess that's the solution. We got this one as well. So, if Bug wasn't defeat, I don't know, if Box wasn't weak right now, would I be able to kill the Bugs? Because it's defeat and weak, or would I 
get defeated, but also destroy them at the same time. I'm not entirely sure, but... Uh... We can't do, like, bug has key at this point. So we, we gotta, like, sacrifice more of them, I guess. No! Oh, shit. We can't push the key there. Uh, oh, boy. This is a, a problem. How do I... How do I do that? Oh, no. This is probably the wrong configuration. So, yeah, I mean, we haven't figured out the level entirely, but... I'm definitely on the right track. I just need to now be key again. Oh, wait, we can do that. I, I don't want to kill off more boxes, though. Hold on. Can I avoid killing too many boxes? By, like, killing this guy instead? That might be better. Now we still have five, but it's a different orientation. And then... Ah, uh, it doesn't seem like it's really gonna do that much anyway. Damn it, this this key is just in the way here. Ah, oh, that doesn't work. It's like I need the different shape. Hold on, let's see. Once again, we're getting to the point of just like... The moves are what matter. Like, we just need to... This feels like very similar to... There was a game I saw, uh... Who was it? Was it Sigma144? The maker of uh, The Witness Randomized? He was playing a, a game... I don't remember the name, but it's like... Some blob game, like jelly game, where you're just like blocks of jello. And you have to like merge and... Readjust and like make different shapes so you can pass through various like areas and stuff. And that just looked like a nightmare to me. And this is basically that. It's just like the thing I don't like. Because, yeah, how else do we do this? If I just kill off one box here, I don't think I can... I can't do that, no. But I could have, like, one gap here instead. No, I mean, that's not gonna... That's not gonna do anything. Yeah, it seems like we need to have the scoop. It seems like we need to have the scoop here so that I can, like, get the and out of here. Unless that's a thing, like, which one of these I actually kill, if that matters. And we definitely need five of them. Somehow five of them have to survive. But, like, this could be in a different spot, I guess. I can't get this out without destroying a box, and surely we can't do that. I, I don't have enough boxes if I do that. Because now I die here. I need one more. How do I save one more box? I don't understand. Oh, boy. It's like I've obviously figured out the puzzle, but I'm not allowed to solve it because I don't have the correct movement and the correct, like, formation. Where, like, this is not really about figuring out the level, it's about doing the level. I don't know, like... There's a difference between executing a solution and figuring out a solution, and I don't like the ones where, like, when you figure out the solution, there's still a huge portion left about how do you do that then? When you know what to do, just not how to do it. That just feels very frustrating to me. 
I just don't see how we could not kill one more box. I guess I can... No. No, I was gonna say, like, I can move and weak onto more bugs, but no, that's not gonna work. And again, like, sure, we could move that into different... different bugs, but that wouldn't really do anything. Like, if we do it here instead... That's not gonna do anything. And moving this around doesn't do anything. I guess we can move this from... Wait, hold on. Which way did I move it last time? Wait, this might be better, because now I have it... Now I have more space. Maybe that's the problem, or that was the problem? Oh, but this isn't gonna work. Yeah, so we can't do that. Hold on, wait, this, this might be fine then. If we do number two again... And we just move this over here. Like, let's just leave a little bit of room. This should be fine, right? Let's see. Or am I missing something that's gonna be a problem? So that's gone. We go through here. But now I can, like, move down here and get this out of here. And then do... No, no, no. We want the opposite. We want... Oh god, how do I do this? No, that's not gonna work. I guess we can just push it, like, here on the left instead. I don't have to have it, like, vertically. Box has key, key is you, like that. There we go. Yeah, again, it's like... The concept, I had the concept figured out long ago, but just how to do it was too frustrating for me. I'm, uh, I'm not so sure about that one. Because, yeah, the puzzle is good. Figuring out the whole bug is weak thing, that's cool. But, boy, moving around is kind of a chore sometimes. Alright, well, still making progress. We have a couple more levels here. I didn't really look at this tiny pasture one, so I guess I'll look at that next time. And then we have the dots and letters. And the, the two dot is completely new, at least. So, we have, like, two completely new levels to look at. And... I guess we'll see if we move on to the next world after that. Like, it's it's getting there. I'm getting fairly close to doing everything, but that is kind of scaring me because I don't want to do everything, but I don't want to, you know, do 99% of the game and then just be like, I can't do this. I quit. It's almost like it would have been better if I gave up long ago so that I didn't feel as if I had to. But yeah, we'll see. I'll definitely be looking up more hints. Let's be very pessimistic next time again, and maybe this uh, this progress streak is going to continue. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you then.